to start this thing up. Hopefully using XSplit, I won't have the problem I had yesterday where I had no video! Okay, since we missed out on basically everything to do with the first uh, few missions of this game, we're going to retry that. The arrival of House Mokai forces from the past is a cause for concern. Jaula is a controversial figure, and we need to handle the situation with caution. The wrong move could spark an interstellar incident, and after recent events, that's the last thing anyone in the Alliance needs. I've arranged a simulation for you. I want you to experience Jaula in action. Get an idea on how she thinks and fights. You might be facing the real thing soon enough, and I want you to be ready if that happens. With the establishment of New Romulus, the Republic has a home for their operations. That also means they have a center from which to aid and protect their other colony worlds. Several Republic colonies are in direct threat from raids and attacks. We want to keep the Republic stable, so we're willing to help in their defense. Join a task force to assist the Romulan Republic in protecting their colonies. As I was saying before that kicked in, let's um, go take care of that thing. I received reports of I've received another recording, and I think it's connected to the prior Tal Shiar one. I'd like for you to follow up and track down any information related to it. We've received another anonymous message. Sucks that I have to redo all this, but it is what it is. But it'll be quicker because I have the teleport pads open.
We have the strength now. With the help of Starfleet and the Empire, we could destroy what's left of the Tal Shiar. We would be safe. We would be free. There are too few of us left to fight amongst ourselves. Military action should be our last option. I don't see how talking to them will be enough. But I'm a warrior, not a politician. If my people are to find a home here, there must be a leader capable of building a new future. Of looking past our differences to find harmony. You are that leader, Ditan. Since I was a child, hiding in the sewers of the capital with the reunificationists, I have worked toward the day when the Romulans would once again walk beside their Vulcan brothers and sisters. Before that can happen, we need to rebuild. We need a home to replace what was lost, to see past our grief and find acceptance. We need to reconcile with the Remans and end the centuries of strife and oppression. The fate of both our peoples rests here. We either create a new home world out of the ashes, or we wither and die. Thank you for agreeing to assist us. I'm grateful that both the Federation and the Empire have temporarily put aside their differences to help create a new Romulus. This proves that unification is possible, both for my people and for yours. We're building a new home here. Romulans and Remans can't continue on like nothing has changed. Everything is different. We are a changed people. The loss of Romulus wounded us greatly. But that wound will not be fatal. There is a great deal of work to do before we can truly call this our new home. But with your help, I know Mold Rihan, or New Romulus in your language, will someday be as great as what we lost. Kylo is in charge of the staging area. He can give you more information about what we need. There's much to do, and little time. We left our first home to remain free. We lost our adopted home to treachery. May this world be the home we have sought for so long, a place where our descendants can live in peace. We have an egregious use of teleportation power. I'll be going now, unless you need anything else. Do you want me to bring you something to eat? No. N no, thank you. I'll see you in the morning. Proconsul, may we speak? How did you get in here? Allow me to introduce myself. I am Sub-Commander Kiana, and I represent certain individuals interested in the future of the Romulan people. Don't patronize me. You mean the Tal Shiar. If you want to be blunt, yes. What do you want, Sub-Commander? An agreement that will benefit us both. You agree to allow us to advise you on the governing of this colony, and in return, we will do all we can to assist you with any complications that may arise. You want to play kingmaker? I'm no king, and deals made in the dark never end well. If you want to open negotiations, contact my office during business hours. You know as well as I do, that would be pointless. There's too much bad blood, and the Federation and the Klingons would never agree. I'd be lucky to leave the negotiations alive. Hakeev's death and the disappearance of the Empress has left my organization at loose ends. 
The Tal Shia needs a strong leader. You have the trust of the Klingons, Starfleet, the Remans. Just imagine what you could do with our help. Are you trying to bribe me? Merely presenting options. A wise man would see that this is his best, his only option. I was instructed by the wisest of men, Subcommander. Spock taught me that openness and truth have more power than secrets. I want all Romulans to unite, even the Tal Shiar. But it can only happen in the light of day. I'll give you time to reconsider. We have similar goals to Tan. You want to rebuild Romulan power. So do we. Think about it. We will speak again. Computer, give me everything we have on the Tal Shi'ar. Who do you think left us this recording, Admiral? Whoever it was is obviously someone who wants us to know everything that's going on behind the scenes. No matter what motivations were for the releasing of the recording, it's good to know that Datan is inside with Tal Shiar. We should probably submit the recording to headquarters. I love that their idea of, of shuttle maintenance is shoot a phaser at it.
It may not seem like much, but every little thing you did contributes to Molrihan. As the Klingons say, the first city was not built in a day. It should be quicker in this time because I've already did the, the hard work the other day. So this is more just catching back up. Go on true, Admiral. We appreciate you taking time. Right now we're having supply problems. There's a Ferengi trader here named Medrin who seems to be capable of making a profit, but less capable of keeping accurate track of our shipments. Tried talking to him, but he seems to treat any conversation as a type of negotiation, and I'm hesitant to escalate the problem to Tatan. Kalor said, suggested a third party might help. Work, might blah, 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 suggested a third party to help us work out a solution. Would you be willing to speak to him on our behalf? Maybe you can get through him. Of course, I'll let you know what I find. You again? Last time I saw you, I had a sweet little mining business on Hifar, and some information brokering on the side. Now, all of that's gone. The mine, the intel, everything. I'm lucky I still have a tooth sharpener. Get out before I call security! We came to talk to you about some irregularities in your supply manifests. Let me guess. Lieutenant Tenenga's complaining again. I stand by my paperwork and my inventory. It's not my fault if the Romulans can't count. They don't have the lobes for business. Look, you can review the cargo manifests yourself and match them to the supplies in the crates. But I'm sure a big, important Starfleet officer like yourself has more important things to do. If you want to bother with it, though, knock yourself out. The terminals in the warehouse have the manifest, and the crates are nearby. I'd help you check, but I have real work to do. Oh, and don't mind the Orions. They're subcontractors working for me. Lots of willing hands to help, <laughs> if you know what I mean. I'll do that. Old uniforms? Why would anyone keep these in a box marked River Pig Chow?
The manifest says this crate is supposed to contain industrial energy cells, but I, I, all I see are some self-sealing stem bolts. According to the manifest, this is supposed to be a three month supply of supplies for science teams working on at the Atai, but half of the boxes are empty. Manifest, this is an entertainment supply, this is scrap hull plating. Anything more? This manifest is completely wrong. This crate is supposed to contain in construction supplies, but it's empty. So, you check the manifests, and the crates, and they don't match up. <laughs> I knew I should have gone with you. And then I could have explained that the more valuable supplies are in a secure storage unit. You can't be too careful, you know. Someone might be trying to steal something. Here, let me open the secure area for you. It's at the far end of the warehouse. For your sake, I hope you're telling the truth.
Well, that was problematic. I don't know what it is about ground combat, but I die so much more during the ground fights than I do during the space fights. I guess this doesn't work, so I can't do that. So I guess I'll just go straight to the mountain base then.
So yeah, we're just running through the missions I was doing yesterday that weren't filmed. Painfully enough. So it should be relatively quick and then from there we can probably move on to doing the Dyson Spear stuff. Since I've already got all of that unlocked as well, so that should be helpful. far. out 
Hang on. Your continued resistance is forcing me to take direct action. This is regrettable, but your deaths will pave the way to a new Romulan star empire. One controlled by the Tal Shiar. Be quiet! You're as loud as a clean... for your assistance. for your assistance. I've visited Deton for the third and final time, Commander. He still worships the Vulcan's memory. He will not see reason. He is only one man, however. If misfortune were to befall him, Intruders, perhaps his replacement would be more accommodating. I have no interest in making martyrs, Sub-Commander. Attacking Detan directly would be yet another distraction from the real issues on this world. In this case, some assistance may be required. You understand the situation? Detan and his people are intractable. I need you to show them the error of their ways. I don't need someone like you to explain things. Do you remember our agreement? Continue to assist us and you'll have your pick of the hunting grounds. The best and most powerful trophies will be yours. I expect something better than that grunting beast by the river. Of course. It is done. Starfleet and the Klingons will be our prey. Squad, the area. Once they are gone, Detan and his followers will be yours to command. Here we go. Be quiet! 
Amazing. Do you think the people will help us gain access to the Tall Shiar codes? We'll submit these recordings to headquarters as well. I'm very glad you could take time to assist us. We've been having some strange occurrences lately. Noises we can't identify are being heard deep in the caves, and our supplies keep disappearing. One of my scientists volunteered to investigate, and he hasn't returned. Would you be willing to look for him? Any scans you could take when you're in the caves would also be very helpful. Yes, we'll look for him.
because I had to switch the gear around a bit so I got the full set that isn't a set from the uh, one that set of issues. I managed to clear up some of the interference. I am detecting Tholian life signs ahead of your coordinates. Please proceed with caution. Napoleon seem to be extracting extensive data about the day one technology. They seem to be particularly interested in eggs and artifacts related to gateway technology. Several floral samples in quarantine. Are they attempting small experiments to see if the planet could be made habitable for them without environmental life? Of course, if the planet is habitable for Tholi, it would be uninhabitable for human life.
These slowly encode access codes look like they'll give us a, a tunnel directly into their main system. Accessing now. Are you, do they work? Are you ready to view the logs? Wait, does this mean that the Tholian attack on the vault was nothing more than a distraction? So why are these artifacts so important? Preparing to submit recording on your command, sir. I'm detecting unusual energy signatures here, similar to the rips in the, in, on Bukhara Pond, but more stable. And we know the Tholians are trying to harness the rips in the form of teleport transportation into, our, into other dimensions. If I had to guess, I'd say that it could be a Tholian transporter. Wouldn't try it though, there's no telling where we would end up. Glad you were able to find the missing scientists. Never expected those caves to be overrun by Tholians. We'll be sending more security to protect the science team. They're determined to finish their work. Thanks to you, they'll have the chance to do so. I'm grateful for all you've done for our colony. We wouldn't be as far along as we are without your assistance. That's why I wanted you here today. 
to hear for yourself some of what we found. Doctor? What we found in our archaeological surveys is that the planet was populated long before our people arrived after the Sundering. We've discovered multiple ruins from that time period that correspond to the few historical records we still have. Most of our data from that era was lost with the homeworld. And the sword? I'm ready to confirm that the blade found at the battle site is the sword of the Raptor Star. We don't have a visual record of the sword, but the one we have matches written accounts, and a quantum analysis shows signs of masterwork. Something like this could have only been made by Saharian. We were right to come here. The sword will become a symbol of our reborn civilization. Um, you were saying there was an earlier culture. What do you know about them? The oldest ruins we found are approximately 150,000 years old but I suspect that there may be some even older, based on preliminary findings that are still being analyzed. These people were quite advanced. While the oldest ruins show a culture that was defined by its devotion to a series of deities, later they developed technology, art, even spaceflight. Roughly 150,000 years ago, however, there was some sort of worldwide seismic event. Every volcano on the planet erupted presumably blocking out the sun. Ambient temperatures dropped dramatically. The radiation count spiked. We're still repairing that damage. The survivors of this cataclysm retreated to caves in the warmest areas of the planet, but they died out soon afterward. And what caused this event? We're still working on that. We have found a new site deep underground near an active volcano, but there are massive power spikes unrelated to the magma flow. If there is a source of the seismic instability, it should be there. We would have to send down a team to investigate, though, and it is quite dangerous. I wouldn't send anyone down without an environmental suit. I could go myself, but... I'm not ready to authorize you to do that, Doctor. Our people have too few scientists left. You and your crew are better equipped and trained for something like this. I know I'm asking a great deal especially after all the help you've given us already. But your being here shows that my people and yours don't have to be adversaries. Not anymore. Not all Romulans think cooperation like this is possible. I do. Are you willing to see it through to the end? Like it's up to us, sir. We would, we would and we should prepare, prepare a full away, and we should prepare a full away team for this assignment. I also should note that we've been given permission to view the security footage for that presentation. Just return to this location and ask one of the security officers. Shall I file the report to report on these findings?
These ruins are ancient by the markings. This area would have been built around the time of the Sundering. The lower levels appear to be much older. I recommend that we investigate deeper to see if we can learn more about the stru this structure and its purpose. We'll, have, we'll need to be careful though. There's no telling what's down there.
Something's wrong with, during the power down sequence. We have perhaps initiated a cascading overload. I think we can deal with it remotely, but it'll take some time. Until then, you will have to shunt power between the relays. If you keep at least two relays functional, we'll be able to handle the power without escalation. If we only have one relay, I don't know what will happen if we stop and stop it over.
Of course, have a timed vision where you have endless waves of enemies, because that's fair. Captain, we've collected all the data for down here we can. Now the obviously teams can get to work analyzing and determining exactly what's down here. And we can adapt it to their use. The power plant is massive. It's, if it is safe to use, it would provide almost unlimited source of geothermal energy for the entire planet. We won't be able to do it, use it right now, though, as long as the Tholians are here, it won't be safe for it to have anyone down here. We will, shall we return to the surface? Reading you loud and clear, Admiral. Heading to head researcher Adana and I are preparing to make our way to you now. We'll see you soon. I received your signal. Thank you for calling us down. I knew we could count on you. Sir, I think I found some kind of log or recording. Can you activate it? I'm not sure. It has some iconography similar to artifacts found in the Isha Forest Cave. This symbol in particular looks... <gasps> is that... An Iconian gateway? Yes, I believe it is. How old are those recordings? The 
This can't be right. The first one seems to be 200,000 years old. The second one was recorded 50,000 years after that. And were those things Iconians? I'm We have a lot of research to do before any of those questions can be answered. This gate is clearly inoperable. Do you believe it could be reactivated? With time, yes, I believe so. <gasps> By the elements! Do you know what this means? It means we have a chance to learn about one of the galaxy's most feared and ancient races. We couldn't have done any of this without you. As amazing as this discovery is, it pales in comparison to what you've done for me and my people. I could never fully or properly express my gratitude for everything you've accomplished since coming to New Romulus. Because of you, the Romulans and Remans truly have a chance at starting a new life. You've helped secure our new home and given us a fighting chance at survival. There are no words that will ever fully express my gratitude. Information discovered from researching this gate will be shared, of course. Some people would be opposed to the releasing of secrets such as these. But time and time again, you have proven that we can all work together. For a brighter future and for a better Romulus, I thank you. Geothermal taps, gotta love them. Excellent work as always. In these past few months, you've done more for the Federation Romulan diplomacy and relations than anyone else in the past few years. In honor of your hard work and excellent service, I have ordered a shipment of materials which should allow you to acquire some much deserved new equipment. I look forward to your next report. Keep up the excellent work. Thank you. Now we know more about the area. It'll be difficult to push the Tholians out, but I know that we, now that we know they're down there, we can be more careful. Also, we now we know what they're looking for. Artifacts from the previous ancient civilization. If they're useful to the Tholians, they're useful for us. We'll do all we can to find them.
Now we'll wait and see if one of those cues will pop. are defending the colony world, Moldreheim, and this is our future, but we maintain a presence here as well. If the planes would plunder the vault and strip it of its technology and weapons, we cannot allow this. Ships are, my ships are fighting the planes, but they are badly outnumbered. Here. Help as many of them as you can.
shields have failed.
Tholian's web is collapsing. Excellent. The vault is secure, but we are not. Sensors show Tholian reinforcements approaching at high warp. Prepare for battle. Congratulations, Admiral. Excellent work. The Republic values our assistance, and these joint ventures will only continue to strengthen those bonds. Now we'll just clean up these last couple of missions that I've already completed the stories for. They, they, they got moved around outside of the main story journal, because that makes sense. And we'll get on to that one next week.
that that's all cleared out, next week we will start on other things. Discovered beneath the surface of the game will be prepared to rate for activation because Romulan Republic is dedicated to sharing the gateway and all we learn from it with our allies. We are inviting representatives of the Romulan Republic, the Federation, and the Klingon Defense Force to join us in the new Romulus for the first trip through the gateway. We'd be honored if you join us at home. Okay, we're where we need to be, so I will see you all on the flip side.